Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and I'm going to take a look at the first hands-on preview for Black State. Now this is of course from IGN by the way. Uh, this is that game that uh, I watched the reveal trailer for around like a month, month and a half, maybe two months ago. Um, I don't know. Time goes by. It might have been two years ago at this point. I don't know. But um, it's a game that looks like it uh it's like a Metal Gear solid if you mix it with like uh um like a like a like a game like a other game that i'm not remembering right now um oh like a max Payne. it had like the slow-mo stuff so so which is funny because that's kind of how i was vi I, I was feeling with the vibes of uh that neo berlin game not the Metal Gear solid part but i had a lot of like the slow-mo and stuff and I'm just like, ooh, I like that there's more slow-mo games coming out. Slow-mo's fun. Fun. Anyway, so let's get to it. This game looks interesting, so I hope it's, uh, I hope every game is good. The only games I, I hope aren't good are like the, uh, like the, like the, what were they called again? The Until Dawn games? The other ones. Dark Pictures. Those are the only ones I don't want to be good because I want them to be cheesy, bad horror movies, so... It's the only times I ever want them to be bad. Because the gameplay doesn't really matter in those games. Anyway, so let's get to it. Let's get to it. 3, 2, 1, play. Oh my god. Was, dude, first, 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 two, first two seconds of a fucking becomes just a pile of blood. I don't know why I love that. When Black State was first welcomed Self. to the world via a vision, I immediately walk out, stab him. <laughs> Fuck Gear you. Solid S teaser yeah. earlier this summer. Some doubted yeah, its go. legitimacy as a game. Was it purely a tech demo injected with the purpose like, of showing off the video? Ah, oh, it's definitely real. <laughs> with that fucking. Game. Was He's it like, oh, He's like, what the fuck? Demo what was that? With the I think I think they were like stunned or something. Purpose of showing off Nvidia's shiny RTX tech. Was it another entry in the recent trend of too good to be true game reveals walking in the sorry footsteps of the day before? Well, I've played Black State, and I'm more than happy oh. to report that not only does it appear to be a real game, but also a really promising oh, wow. one full of gory, explosive. Like I said, oh, as, <laughs> as if I'm not watching the first hands on preview. Wow, he actually played it. Action and cinematic sci fi style, powered by handsome visuals and a playful physics engine. Cool. I actually wasn't expecting to, to see videos of people saying they've played this game anytime soon. My demo started by taking control of a stealth suited long haired man aboard a cargo ship. It's impossible mm, to no, not be No, no, it's not like, no, it's not like any of those, no. No, it's completely new. Of the opening no, of Metal Gear Solid no, 2, no. Uh. Stomp along its main deck, admiring no, its uh. reflective metals and the choppy waters around wow, it. looks really Omer good. Farouk Gungor, studio director at Black. All right, I will say, even though this looks good, there's something about this that feels like you're not on the ocean. You know what I mean? If it, if it, like I don't know why it it looks great. The water looks great. The ship itself looks great. The, I don't know why. Immediately, my my too. vibe was like, I feel like I'm not on the, in the ocean. I, I don't know. Like I'm not isolated on this ship in the ocean. Admiring its reflective metals and the choppy waters around it. Omer Farouk Gungor, studio director at Black playing it, Turkish fair. developer Motion Blur, Some is keen to water. point out the game's graphical prowess, yeah. and he's not wrong to do so. Yeah. It really is a stunner, shining brightly over the course of the 20-minute demo. It's almost real. But what's perhaps more impressive is how well it runs. Was that actually his voice? That's great. Even with it's almost real. Ray tracing turned on, the frame rate rarely dips below 60, and the demo hits a steady 140 FPS during non-combat situations on the RTX 4080 based rig I played on. But as I mentioned, and as Gungor goes to lengths to insist, Black State isn't a tech demo. It's a story-driven action game of huge ambition. After making my I'm way up the ship's deck and entering one of its many doors, that scope all starts to become apparent. Doors in Black State aren't your traditional gateways into neighboring rooms, but instead portals to wildly different locations. After stepping through yeah. the heavy bolted chip, that's right. Gateway, it was it was it was compared. It was like Metal Gear Solid mixed with Max Payne mixed with Portal. That's what the original pitch was. For instance, I find myself in a museum. Its shiny hardwood floors and spotless glass cabinets a far cry from the industrial oceanic setting of moments before. Where is this place? We don't know. But I'm glad these all survived. Hopefully, this trick will provide not only narrative intrigue, but ambitious level design that links multiple types of environments together. Google like reveals little of blood. 
What was the show? Just level design. Oh, look. it's to go into cover. I thought you could look through the computer or something. It's like multiple that. types no, of environments to together. Google reveals little of Black State's story, but hints of a sci-fi adventure that may deliberately oh, confuse at first before coming together and bringing its disparate, portal-gated worlds together. He cites Inception as a key inspiration, and the more I play, Very the more that rings true. It's not just the dream heist masterpiece. They only play twenty minutes. Reminded of though, but the sci-fi thriller movies of Christopher Nolan in general. There are hints of Tenet in there, not only through its aesthetic, but in the gameplay too. A mix of shooting and close quarters combat against black clad commando units. This isn't the brand of tactical espionage action its opening cargo ship section initially conjured memories of. In fact, Black State plays much closer to Remedy's brand of high octane action than I was any getting, of Kojima. I was actually getting a Remedy vibe a little bit. Especially, I mean, kept seeing Max Payne, but like I was also thinking of uh, um, Quantum Break. To gear solid entries. How they spot me? <laughs> How they spot me? My first encounter is against a squad of enemies who rappel down into the museum's corridor. I immediately do what I always do when the option is made available. Oh push the button that triggers bullet time. The slowdown mechanic oh, is yeah. on a cooldown timer, but one generous enough wow, to Wow, that's me very use it generous. I just saw it in the bottom right. Look at that Look bar. Time. Look how quick that shit recharges. Is on a cooldown timer, but one generous enough to let me use it with relative abandon. I'm it, a, I'm gonna assume that's gonna go. That the, the charger is gonna be slower when uh the game actually comes out. Looks and feels fantastic. Just yeah, it as looks it like the original it, Max Payne to roll out of cover at quarter speed before unleashing a hail of bullets into an enemy pathetically stuck in real time. Four different weapons were made available in the demo, allowing me to leave a trail of destruction frankly unbefitting of the classy surroundings. Alongside a relatively standard pistol and assault rifle combo, there's a fantastically powerful shotgun yes. capable of completely of yes. limbs of Yes! Mm. I'll be no! And there's the more powerful sci-fi flavored fusion gun. This energy weapon discharges yeah, a burst saw. of electricity into an oh, enemy. Oh, it's like uh, the gun from uh, Resident Evil 2 a little bit. After a short delay, except that doesn't happen. <laughs> makes them explode into a gory pile of goo. It again looks and feels fantastic, especially when paired with bullet time, allowing you to watch bits of blood and bone elegantly fly. He's like, oh boy, can't wait to get them back to my kids. I'd be lying if I didn't say I love my it. kids. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Alongside the guns is a selection of gadgets too. The ones I had access to were similar in fun. nature to the division's seeker mines. Yeah, you got me. grenades that scuttle towards your target before either blowing them up or stunning them. An electrical charge version was also ready to be deployed by the nameless protagonist. That guy just got fucked up. He he like, so, I have so many bullets <laughs> inside me right now. Towards your target oh, oh, oh shit, oh, okay, okay, let me get down. Oh, them. fuck. An electrical charge version right. was oh, also oh, ready shit, to oh, be deployed oh, by oh, the oh, nameless oh. protagonist. <laughs> A device Gungor teases would be effective against robotic enemies that appear later in the story. The playable section ends Robot. in a secret lab area. Is that the Mo Mona Lisa? You're an overrated piece of shit. Then found behind a key card locked door upon which the mo The original basic bitch. Mona Lisa sits proudly. Huh? It's an area that brings together all of Black State's apparent influences. The experimental science of Metal Gear Solid, the battle-ready scientists in bodysuits of Remedy's Quantum Break, the clinical orchestrated violence of Nolan's Tenet. It makes for a lengthy combat sequence in which a dozen or more enemies attack from all corners, pressuring me to use all of the aforementioned tools at my disposal. This kind of game you want to play on like the hardest difficulty. Fall of Black Snake's like... combat encounters are this well structured. It seems but... like you're really overpowered. And I think it will prove to be more than just a robust shooter. The resulting mess is one of great delight. As people become exploded innards and dress the bleach one. I wish there was more blood on the ground. I know that's asking a little much. Surfaces in lashings of deep red. This gory, bordering on over-the-top violence is another of Gunga's touchstones. The often brutal spectacle of a Quentin Tarantino action scene. It's a homage best showcased when a body flies across the room after taking a shotgun. Just imagine how amazing a Quentin Tarantino video game would be. Shell a point <laughs> Kill Bill. And range. A la Django Unchained's final bloody Put shootout. Ball, I'm going to get it all to the... Yeah, get the fuck out of here. I always loved that part. Shoots her in that angle and gets pulled back like that. It's so funny. Motion blur is a <laughs> bomb is long. <laughs> with black state then. And for what I've played, it's showing promising signs it can reach those heights. 
at least in the foundational gameplay department. It remains to be seen if the overall level design can continue to creatively support Black State's inventive place hopping concept, as well as escalate we'll with see. a hopefully ever evolving tool set. I'm also largely in the dark on its narrative, and so can't yet tell if Motion Blur's writing talent matches its skill for slick firefights. But I'll say, like, that guy's face looks really weird. Can't yet tell if Motion Blur's writing talent matches. He looks like Ron Perlman. <laughs> skill for slick firefights. But even if a full release is quite a while away yet, I've got a good feeling. The eye-catching reveal my guess would be next year. had my curiosity, but after playing it, its blend of intriguing sci-fi story and setting, brutal yet balletic time-bending action, and simply stunning graphical sheen now firmly has my attention. For more Black State, stick around in this video for an extended look All right. at some gameplay. You're in a gen M lab, but there's no record in our data. Must be a secret. Search everywhere. Alright. Okay. We got some gameplay here. I mean, this is probably a gameplay where it's. Oh. It's back with hostiles. Understood. That's what I was for. Okay. He doesn't really sound like Snake. It was just that one time. He sounds like a rough military guy. Uh, no more weekly. Or no weekend visits to your kids. Oh, the audio kind of took a shit there. He's just gurgling on his own blood. Last thought was seeing his mom, who's in hospice. <laughs> Hold up, wait a minute. Let me put some... Yeah, yeah. Over here, by the banyan trees. <laughs> he, 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 he shot that glass way more than he shot a person so far. What the f- That's sick. Dude, he saw his body. He's like, he's like, shit! <laughs> I like how that doesn't blow people up into pieces, but that fucking electrical one does. Uh, God damn it! God damn! It. <laughs> God damn. Over, here. Over here! God damn, man. <laughs> the gameplay does look pretty fun, I'll say. Admittedly, it looks really fun. Come on, for more, check fuck? out a full eight minutes of Black State gameplay, oh. and for everything else, stick with IGN. Where the fuck did this come from? Is this has this been out already? Like before? Six days ago? What the fuck? How did I miss this? I'm assuming this is the gameplay that they're showing right here. I did not know they had that. <laughs> some dislikes on this. Take a look at some brand new Black State gameplay, a new sci-fi shooter up I'm completely missed it, wow. Game people played in movies and TV show, really? Acid Store of the Reckoning. Look at all this art. Glad someone saved it. Proceeds to throw grenades. Looks awfully clean. They could at least give him a better running average like Tom Cruise or a graphic or something. Truly. Then we had a new series work. Okay. Well, let's, wa let's watch this. Fuck it. I don't even care. Okay. So. This wasn't a mission, but it could uncover everything we need. Now you can everybody, is everybody saying this is all asset store stuff? Use map maker. Understood. I mean, the voice acting is not too bad. Either. My thing is, if the game is good, I don't really care how many assets they use. I, I personally, I just I don't care. As if the game is good at, at itself, then I don't really fucking care if they didn't create every single fucking model. The map maker will catch up after the scan. I don't know, he's going invisible like a... What's his name, Jack in uh, Gears of War? The, is that... Yeah, that's called Jack. What about Cameron? Nothing's changed. She's still the priority. But if you can find the missing part and bring Decius back to life... The voice acting's pretty solid, actually. It might help us uncover the truth behind everything. Where exactly is Decius? It was the first super-intelligent machine. Decius warned us before everything. They said it malfunctioned, harmed human subjects, and then shut it down. Enough talk. Focus on the mission. 
That was definitely supposed to be like a... What did that voice remind me of? Focus on the mission. Uh, something popped in my brain and then completely gone. I was like, that remind. Oh yeah, that voice is definitely supposed to be like, and then I'm like... Shit, now I don't remember. Yeah, showing off them graphics. I mean, this makes sense for it all be white if a museum like this. Wow. Wow. I thought all of these were lost. Where is this place? We don't know, but I'm glad these all survived. The map maker will scan them all for recreation. But who saved all these? You know, who collected them while the rest of the world faced catastrophe? That's Elon exactly Musk. What we're trying to learn. Do you think uh, Elon Musk, when he sees see something he wants to buy, he's like, oh, that's an Elon Musk. I bet he says that. Fucker. Why does everything look so good, too? Like, like the actual, like, modeling. Like, just did that one statue Fire earlier. Right that bars. one, like, they all look like pictures. You know what I mean? High-res pictures they just put up there with their 3D models. So, I mean, obviously, let's take a bunch of pictures of the actual things, I assume. And then, all right, so we saw a lot of this gameplay in that hands-on, but it's nice to see it all in one go. I wish I knew about this. I can see why this guy gameplay got some dislikes. I bet people were like, what the fuck, man? It's just walking. I wouldn't want to have to go through glass like this. How did I spot me? Oh! Oh, <laughs> the motherfucker reacted to that headshot like he just got hit by a grenade. It's a powerful bullet, bro. Like, I don't know why that crump, like oh, that pile of glass there, looks looks really good. <laughs> like little things like that. There you go, blow them up. Okay, okay, boss. <laughs> uh, why would you roll on the glass? <laughs> this is no good. Solid three. That would not go over well. <laughs> for a naked snake, <laughs> it has to be fucking destroyed. <laughs> Taking me back to the days where they only had like one or two footstep noises. Brum, 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 brum. That's like three, three footstep noises. It's almost real. Like Silent Hill. She had like the clock, 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 clock. Glock, 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 that sounds like your mom. <laughs> nah, she's a good lady. Oh, that's part. I don't think we saw. It must lead somewhere important. What is this, a Yu-Gi-Oh card? What is this? Is that a fucking tarot card? What the fuck were they looking at? I guess it was a key card, but... It looked fancy. <laughs> I like the most Resident Evil move. Um... Resident Evil moment so far. Right there. A random ass key card in a museum that could open a thing. That's about right. Alright, I'm getting sick of him fucking waddling about. Dude, they, yeah, they, 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 need to, they need to add more footstep noises. I think I found a new portal. Or get the motherfucker to pick up his feet a little bit better. I think I found a portal. This one leads right into uh, a toilet? No. Everything's white. You're in a Gen M lab, but there's no record. I know, you're in the, the heat tunnel thing from Melgar Solid 4. Alright, 
the microwave thing that takes Snake to get through, like for like 40 yeah, minutes. Ah! Understood. Go see what this lab is for. There we go. So we saw this gameplay. I guess we can probably stop. Yeah, we saw this. Here, I, how about this? We'll watch the rest. Uh, two times speed. Watch him clear this area real quick. Here go. There's no, yo, there's no audio there makes it, made it even funnier. Two times speed. Yeah, go, yeah, go. Hold on. Enemy here. Oh, shit. Over here. Oh, I like his uh, that guy was alive a second ago. <laughs> move, move, move! <laughs> who, who you talking to? Those motherfuckers are exploding. <laughs> yeah, they are pretty stupid. Okay. They do that thing I, I, I do get sick of in, in, uh, in, uh, in action games like this. They just rush you. They know they're not real, so they're just like, well, if we rush them, then he can't win. And our, that's our whole purpose in the game is for the player not to win. So we rush them, even though, like, I don't know. Like, I think Last of Us is, like, the perfect. No, 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 not perfect. Definitely not. But, like, Last of Us 1 and even, and 2, actually, more so. Um, the AI is, like, like you could tell they, they don't want to die, really. <laughs> like, I don't know. At times. There's probably other times where the AI is fucking stupid as shit. Like, you know how many times in the first uh, Last of Us where Ellie would just walk over a mine or something and it would blow up and it wouldn't hurt her but fucking alert the enemy. And that happened like, well, that only happened a couple times. But, um, and Ellie would just be like stand there even though we're supposed to be stealthing. I'm like, get down, Ellie. So, can't really say that. But there's, there's moments where the AI is like, like obviously you could tell her like shit we'll fucking die fuck this you know um anyway there you go that's it uh that, that, was, that was good and the game looks fun it does look fun so i'm looking forward to it so there you go that's it hope you enjoyed the next time i'll see you guys there goodbye